Well, hi everyone. I'm CEO of Answers and Genesis Creation Museum and the Ark Encounter. And today we're going to talk about jobs, jobs, and more jobs and jobs. And we need you. And we have some very specialist jobs uh, that we need people to fulfill here at Answers and Genesis. I have with me our VP of AV. This is mm -hmm. Ben. And Ben, we're in well, it's a control room, yes. a video control room. The video room control room. At the Answer Center at Correct. the Ark. Yes. And of course, we have similar facilities at the Creation Museum we as do. well. We're renovating those right now. And we are renovating them, upgrading them totally. So, uh, ready for next year. Now, AV services. We're going to go through and list. You know what? I've got pages here of all the jobs that we have listed on our website answersandgenesis.org, down the bottom, the menu, you'll see jobs there and go there. But I wanted you to tell people what jobs you have available with AV, first of all. Yes. So here at the Answer Center and the Ark Encounter, we have three jobs that we're looking to fill soon, hopefully. Um, and they're in AV technology. We're looking for three technicians. So, you know, part of the responsibilities, obviously, is helping within this room. But a lot of the job is daily operations, taking care of live sound for special events and concerts and things like that. So, um, you know, that, that's really what we, we have a great need uh, right now here at the Answer Center for that, that particular position. And, you know, Answers in Genesis, uh, which is the mother ministry of the Ark Encounter and the Creation Museum, uh, people are coming here from all across America, actually. Yeah. And the fact that we're a Christian ministry uh, yes, people have to sign our statement of faith to, to work here, uh, but they love the environment. It's like an oasis in the middle of a desert these days, isn't it? Yes, it is. And with all that's going on in the secular world, there are more and more people saying, we just can't have this anti-God worldview forced upon us, and we want to work in a Christian ministry, use our talents in a Christian ministry. Yeah. And so, not just uh, with AV, but even Answers TV, our Absolutely. streaming platform. Yes, so we're looking for a director position for our Answers TV. We just launched that about a year ago, a little over a year ago, actually. And, um, you know, we're, it's growing. It was in its embryonic stages, now we're growing, and uh, we need somebody to help us lead that. And we have, I think we have about 300 full-time salaried staff and uh, upwards of 300 of full-time uh, hourly staff, and then we have seasonal mm -hmm. people that we need as well. We need special seasonal people, extra seasonal people at Christmas time, of course. Absolutely. And we need seasonal people through the summer, and we're actually building some housing here at the Ark Encounter as well. Uh, so I was just looking through the list here. We need uh, a Vice President of Advancement, and then an Ararat Ridge Zoo, a Zoo Facilities Technician, Attractions Design. There's a number of positions in attractions design, assistant content writer, exhibit artist. Uh, we have some intern positions, some paid and unpaid. Uh, then we have a lead 3D digital artist, uh, projection design, project designer, I should say, and art director. Uh, we also have some attractions operations needs, culinary services. Uh, in, hey, if you're a chef, uh, you know, we have all sorts of needs here at Anson Genesis, a line cook. Uh, culinary services specialist, and then educational content, curriculum development specialist. Uh, we also have a number of other positions there as well. Uh, fabrication, production uh, fabricator, facilities maintenance, we need an HVAC technician, a journeyman plumber, uh, finance, accountant, guest services, a number of different people in guest services, horticulture, grounds manager, and a horticultural technician and some other specialist in horticulture. Housekeeping, there's a lot of positions actually in housekeeping. Uh, human resources, oh, that's HR, even they have positions. And then some of our internships, learning and development, marketing positions, uh, retail, uh, technology, cabling technician, full stack developer, IT solutions developer, uh, senior cabling court. I don't even know what half these positions. Do you know what they, these are? <laughs> Not all of them. I, I don't know what those positions are. Warehouse, video production. What about video production? Um, actually, we have. We were looking for a 3D, 2D animator, and we, thankfully, we just hired. Ah, someone. so yeah. just hired someone. There's yeah. 3D, 2D, and see the positions are getting filled. Uh, so we have lots of positions available. But we're really in urgent need right now of AV technicians. Very urgent need, yes. And that's yeah. for the answer center yes. here at the Ark Encounter. Uh -huh. 
and we have three positions available just for so that. So explain those three positions again. Yeah, so they're uh, primarily um, the idea is to help with daily operations. Obviously, that includes the ARC encounter, but also here in the Answer Center. We have a lot of events that go on in here. It's helping live sound or with live sound for special events and concerts. We just had you know, several concerts over the summer with 40 days and 40 nights. All of that needed technical support. Uh, Christmas time here at the Ark. There's a lot of technical support that goes into that. So it's live sound, it's lighting, you know, it's some video work, um, projection. The, the ministry sort of took off exponentially, didn't it? it did. And with the yeah. opening of the Answer Center, suddenly it, yeah. it really took off. So let's just walk out there, show okay. people the Answer Center, and we're going to meet with our uh, VP of HR out there who will just give you a little overview of how you can apply for a position here. Mm -hmm. So let's do that then. We'll uh, walk out here. And just to show you, so to come here to the Answer Center and to be able to work in AV, and that was the video control room. And here, uh, you can see this is the auditorium. We're just getting set up for another event, actually, our College Expo that's occurring here. You can see where so, some of these people that where we want to hire would work from down here, right? They would. So you can see the control center. Um, it's at the back of the answer center here, obviously. We have a lot of video equipment here, but you can see the sound console there and everything that runs the LED wall on the stage and specialty lighting. We need people who are interested in all those, all those things. So there we are. We have lots of positions available. So I'm going to ask Deborah, who is our VP of HR, to tell us a little bit of an overview uh, about all the positions available and how people can apply. So Deborah, can you do that? Please? Absolutely, Ken, thanks. Yes, as Ken went through the list, you can gather that we have quite a few positions at the Answer Center that we, at the Ark Encounter, at the Creation Museum, at Answers in Genesis. All of these locations, we're looking to fill some positions. If you're interested in getting a few more details, what we'd encourage you to do, Ken, is the easiest thing is to go to AnswersInGenesis.org, scroll all the way down to the bottom, click on that Jobs button. This will take you and will show you the entire list of the positions that we have open. You can click on any position there that you're interested in, and it will give you more details about what that position does. It's going to give you a position description. So it's going to really describe to you what that job does what your responsibilities would be, your expectations. Ben went through a high level overview of the AV, so you will see the job description there. And then you click a button and it takes you right to the application process. So you can do it all from going to answersingenesis.org and scroll into the bottom to where it says jobs. It's as simple as that then? It's as simple as that. And uh, there'll be ask certain questions and yes. of course told about our requirements as an employer. Absolutely. Obviously we have a statement of faith uh -huh. so you will have the opportunity to read it there as part of the application process. We have screener questions that we're going to ask that you fill out and then from there it's real easy. We just collect your personal information, you upload your resume, click a button and you're now an applicant. There we are and uh, then we will actually uh, the person will hear from Correct. HR. Correct. And uh, again, we have a lot of positions. Do you know how many positions there are going right now? So yes, yeah. so the list you just went through, if you look at our full-time positions, we have roughly 60. About 60 full-time positions. Yes. And it's an opportunity to work in a growing Christian ministry. Absolutely. A well-established Christian ministry. Absolutely. And we have the two leading Christian-themed attractions in the mm -hmm. world. Uh, the largest creation apologetics yes. uh, ministry, largest conservative apologetics ministry actually around and what an opportunity for people Absolutely. and uh, we just uh, encourage them to apply and come and work in a Christian ministry. Mm -hmm. We have great benefits for our staff. We do. We offer a full benefit package. So the medical, dental, vision, 401k, life insurance, different perks that we have with attractions in the area such as Kings Island, things of that nature. So a full benefit package. And people who look at the benefit package realize, wow, this is really, it's spectacular really. It, it really is. I will tell you that most industries, organizations are not able to provide, especially with the medical benefits that we are able to provide, they're not able to do that at the cost that we're able to do it. 
And those that are employed here too, we even have a benefit uh, in regard to our 12 Stones Christian Academy, a Christian school. We do. So you get the discount to, for the children to go to 12 Stones. So just many, many benefits. Now, as well as all these full-time positions, we have a need for seasonal positions. Yes, we do. Just about all year long, right? (laughs) We do seasonal positions at any particular point in time. Obviously, we're getting ready for the Christmas season here, so we do have a need at both the Creation Museum and the Ark Encounter for seasonal positions. That's high school, college age. Absolutely. Retired people. Retirees. People who want to make it a little extra money for Christmas. Yeah, if you're a school teacher. School teacher, and you've got yep. a couple of weeks off at Christmas and you need to make a little extra spending money, what a great opportunity to come work here, support the ministry, and earn a little extra spending money. And then during the summer, we have hundreds of seasonal positions. We do. Hundreds. We do. It's in the hundreds, uh, like several hundred positions that we look for during the summer. So we are actually right now, Ken, recruiting at college universities, looking for college students to come join us. And we have some housing available. We have housing for individuals, college students that can come and spend the summer with us. That's available, many different perks there for college students, high school students, uh, retirees, individuals that we've also learned that individuals that have RVs and want to come spend a month here with us, absolutely come apply for a seasonal position. And, you know, it's interesting, we've seen a number of people, even retirees that say they're moving to Northern Kentucky so that they can volunteer at the ministry or work and supplement their, you know, social security income. We have that sort of thing happening. Mm -hmm. We have others who are saying we're moving away from some of these liberal areas uh, and bringing their children, family out here to be a part of a Christian ministry. And uh, we're we're seeing uh, a lot of people who are starting to gravitate here because Mm -hmm of the Answers in Genesis Ministry, the Creation Museum, and the Ark Encounter. Mm-hmm. So um, with that, uh, go to answersingenesis.org, go down the bottom, and you'll see all the different menus there where you see jobs, click on that, and then you'll be able to find out all of those positions, about 60 full-time positions 60 right now. 60 full-time. And then you can also, have, what about seasonal? If they want to apply for seasonal, what do they do there? So you're going to go to the same location, answersingenesis.org, Scroll all the way to the bottom, click that jobs button, and you will see the list of seasonal positions that we have there as well. So it's very easy. We look forward to seeing you apply and to be here working at Answers in Genesis Creation Museum in the Ark Encounter and our real desperate need right now. Uh, well, it's all of these is a desperate need, it but is- we really need those AV people. Yes, Ben would like to get three AV technicians here to help support what we're doing yep. at the Answer Center Ark Encounter. And if you can be here tomorrow, he would, well, <laughs> have if to you go apply, through a bit of a process. If you apply today, we will follow up with you <laughs> real soon. So there we are. Um, well, thank you and have a blessed day and check out the jobs available here at Answers in Genesis.